Welcome back, Sweden, to your Caribou Data Science channel. Today is a Sunday, uh, April 25th, 2021, here in the U.S., and it's time for that time of week when you get not one report, but two reports for the price of one. In addition to your weekly COVID-19 analysis, you also get the free report, the free weekly vaccine rollout report for Sweden today, okay? By the way, thanks so much if you have subscribed. If you haven't subscribed, it's very simple. Click the subscribe button. Click the bell beside to be notified whenever I post a new report. And also be sure to click the like button. And most important of all, click the share button. Share this video with one person today, okay? So let's get started with the first report, which is the uh, vaccine rollout report. You can see that we got a bit of a problem here, don't we? I mean, wow. Let's just come back over and see if we can do something here. Let's run this one more time. So they didn't start. Four twenty. Let's just try four fifteen. Okay. Apparently, for whatever reason, you got a really late start on your vaccine on your vaccination program. Okay. Because as of uh, four twenty three, you you've administered twenty seven point nine million doses. And so far, uh, a little over 2 million have received a single dose, while only 710,000 have been fully vaccinated. So that works out to about, oh, I don't know, what's the population of Sweden? Ten point nine million. Okay. Let's just take a look at this one more time then. Okay, if you have ten point nine million, this means you're at about as far as full vaccination. Well, you're about Let's say one third to one fourth the way through where you need to be. Because you need to have about well, the claim is 50% full vaccination rate, you start seeing any real benefit. What about over here now? So you can see over here about 20, 22%, 25% have received a single dose, while less than 10%. Well, less than 10 have received a full dosage. So you you folks have definitely got some work to do on your hands, okay? That concludes our first report. Let's go over and take a look at the uh, the daily report, which is which actually not it's not run daily, but it only shows that's this report is of course running two a week, Thursday and Sunday. Okay, just just to clarify that. And of course, this is a reminder, for some reason, to be honest my understanding, Sweden only records the, the cases and deaths Tuesday through Friday, which of course, presumes, of course creates a huge spike in, in the numbers on, on Monday, okay? Or on Tuesday, okay? Here's the spike, here's the Tuesday spikes. This is what the rest of the week looks like, okay? This is a 28 moving average for cases. Okay. So each one of these columns is the average number of cases. So for the period ending April 4th, you've averaged 5,566 5, cases. Okay. 
per, per day. What about deaths? This is how messy a deaths look. But it's come down here. And for the, and for the uh, 28 day period ending April the 4th, <laughs> April the 4th, you average 18.7 deaths. Now, you, now your mortality rate, your deaths rate is still pretty low. You see, you see, you got an increase in, in cases here, in cases here on a weekly basis. We, had the, we saw this decline here in the last two weeks. We've seen an increase in the number of cases. Okay. Monthly cases. Monthly deaths. So There's a pretty good chance that you, you could have one of the lowest deaths in uh, one, two, three, in, in five weeks. Okay. So now we're going to compare uh, Sweden with EU countries with a population of 9 to 12 million. You can see Sweden in this group has the third most cases at over 100,000 cases total and the third most deaths uh, with about 2,500 deaths total. Okay, this is the daily cases by country. This is the daily deaths by country. This is the cumulative total. Okay, note cumulative totals can do one or two things. They can go up or they can level off. Right now, we're not seeing any, we're not seeing any flattening of the curve right now. But in deaths, you had a climb up here. Now it has starting to level off a little bit. Okay, the curve has started to flatten just a little bit. Okay, with deaths. So this is death, cumulative cases by country, by country, and cumulative deaths by country. Okay. So this does conclude the report for Sweden for today. Thanks so much for your time. Don't forget to click that share button. Share this video with one person today. Ready? Thanks so much, Sweden. We'll catch you in a, in a few days. We'll catch you on Thursday with a new report.